it's it's Friday noon, and my resume of this week, um, I I didn't got healthier. Like, um, did my calves get smaller? Well, I kind of reorganized it, so I'm standing in the middle of some chaos. But well, it's usually getting worse before it's getting better. At least this is what I'm keep telling me. So. Yeah. What did I do with my project snippets? Oh yeah, I just took them out, was like, no, no, I'm not gonna do this, and put it back in. I did this with several, so, <laughs> but yeah, there is uh, one huge project and I put it already into 17 small snippets. So yeah, of course, with 40, 40 snippets in total, it's um, a high, um, number of times you're pulling one of those and i wasn't really into this so but i know i have to do this because it's uh taking up a lot of space around me so this is what i reorganized you guys i, I hate my place so but i want to have this done <laughs> to not move it anywhere just i don't know how i'm gonna sell this but um or what I'm gonna do with this, but I want to make this project. And so far, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, this, this, and uh, I mean, you're standing on my uh, crafting desk, and oh boy, it's it's looking absolutely nice, astonishing. Yeah, my table, uh, my laptop is is. I place there and um, I really want to put another Linux system on there but I'm a kind of too stupid to do this so I've given up on this weeks ago um, do I even have it no it's not a snippet I, I just I just put this on a real to-do list because I have to do this anyway so it's not like oh yeah I can do it there today or I can do it in, in two weeks or something but um, Kind of frustrating yeah and and plus we are in the 40 days in this dark sad days before eastern so the decoration is the christmas decoration i put that put that down but there is not eastern yet so i'm usually not supposed to put my easter decoration back up and now it's really sad in dark upstairs. Yeah. Plus, I need to go to the attic. I love the basement, but I hate the attic. Hey. <laughs> where's, where's the mistake? Just give it to me. So, yeah, I'm actually standing in the basement. So, yeah, I like the basement. But the attic is spooky. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, boy. So yeah, I'm, I'm looking around and I'm having a lot of stuff to do and instead, oh yeah, oh yeah, I, oh, oh, I'm so, I'm so, instead of actually minimizing my projects, I um, made one box bigger so I could all, put all my booklets in there because they have a different uh, special size and um, yeah, so I did this first, so this is the project I talked about last week so I just did this and um, yeah I was looking for paper crafts actually how to do them and hey boys oh guys I'm I'm out I'm out um Epson no not Epson not Epson this is the printer we have but Canon and brother do have autumn awesome awesome creative studio things like you can actually make so many paper crafts you just can print them out so on canon i actually put in my i, I, I made an account so i can every do everything with canon id and did download a lot of stuff so the cologne cathedral so yeah i'm, I'm born in cologne so yeah of course the cathedral which is our site you can craft it. 
like I have paper. It's I mean it's just forty three pages uh, you have to print. Um, yeah, just and cut. I mean you have to cut all of this, and it's a uh, really nice cutting stuff. Um, but hey, I have it, and and there's so much more. There is so much. There are so many awesome things, and I thought, oh yeah, like just take. I, I started on the brother page, which was less with less stuff, and I thought, oh yeah, this is nice. This is nice. Oh yeah, come come on, just pick twenty four, and you're having like your vlogmas ready for next year, or for this year, <laughs> and um, yeah, I started to make actually um, how I want to present this. So yeah, I, I started to preparing stuff for for yeah, next year Christmas. <laughs> no, I'm not weird. Mm. No, no. Yeah, what else didn't I do? Uh, well, a project. So yeah, I've I've made two projects instead of decreasing some. Um, with the paper crafts, I'm <laughs> like. When you look at this, like, okay, I don't, I don't, it's, it's ridiculous. I mean, yes, I, I studied, I studied mechanical engineering and I, I, I uh, had these, uh, different lessons on the computer, which is with cut, with auto cut and auto desk and well, to make those models. Ah. <sighs> Well, still, Katia and I, we are not, we are never going to be friends. Never, never, ever. Um, but Autodesk is pretty nice. So Inventor, and it's even cheaper than Katia. Well, <laughs> cheaper. <laughs> yeah, those licenses, like 20,000 to 50,000 euros. Hey, come on, it's, it's cheaper. <laughs> oh, boy. Yeah, when your teachers are people that are actually making cars, designing cars for Ford in your hometown. <laughs> this is uh, what you have to deal with. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I had I had funny teachers. So the guy who did it didn't tell anybody. But another teacher was so impressed that he t told us what the other teacher actually had done. Um, like, yeah, he, um, designed this whole car, uh, inside, outside, and then he took screens and he placed so many screens that he had already visualized fully how this car is looking. So he took some chairs and then those screens and he just like, okay, sit down and now you're sitting in the car, kind of like super crazy. Uh, so this is how detailed this stuff was going. Um, yeah, so people, <laughs> so the guys that were supposed to do the car <laughs> actually could drive it virtually, like in this real size. So not not like a flight. Well, even the flight simulators here, you, you get this this huge thing. So well, I grew up in a time with joysticks, and where you did all this stuff. By the way, have you seen joysticks? Like, I mean, <coughs> I haven't seen some of these. Like, yeah, you can find some online, but <laughs> yeah, never mind. Uh, yeah, so cut. So yeah, with the paper craft. So actually, you can just make a model and put it into another software, and it's making. It's just like ripping up all the surfaces and making yourself some paper crafts. And I was like, awesome, nice. <laughs> yeah, so I'm like, okay. So I have to go into cut and modeling the stuff. But yeah, I mean, I want to do some gaming stuff as well. So. Yeah, I mean, I, I I I tried to figure out how to motivate myself, how to get myself back onto track. 
because apparently I'm not too much into any psychiatrists, psychologists. Um, I, I don't know. I know one is allowed to write down medicaments and, and some pharmaceutical stuff and the other isn't and ah, there are these my differences but I don't know who is who and actually I don't want to get medication so <sighs> but anyways I need to put this forms I these surveys I just I didn't do this I think I have them like four or five weeks well <laughs> I got asked in the last, after the last thing, last weekly update thing, uh, like, hey, yeah, you need to see a psychologist. <laughs> yeah. I saw this guy when there was like snow, snow like this. So I really was, what is it, eight inch? So <laughs> I was with my hiking boots. And um, my hiking boots were super cool when I bought them. But now I just have bloody feet all over so there are blisters and they hurt horribly but I didn't know which other shoes to take because it was slippery it was cold and yeah it was they were the best shoes I could think of so and I asked him a day before so <laughs> when it wasn't snowing that much I asked that guy if I could bring my dog with he was like, yeah, if uh, there's no other opportunity, sure you can, but um, it would, I, I would also like if you just keep him. Well, if you have an opportunity to keep him at home. Yeah, so I was like, okay, so the guy is not 100% on dogs. So I put a jacket on my dog. So he isn't all wet, wasn't all wet. And I mean, of course, with this weather, I'm taking my husky mix with me. <laughs> this, this were the best, uh, the was the best anchor I could get, right? With this, yeah, weather going on. So, yeah, the dock was dry and all that. And even though I just tried to get as much, uh, as, the highest amount of my shoes. Um, there were still snow on my shoes, and they were still wet. So, and there was this carpet. <laughs> so he had like had like this seared wood <laughs> and on top of the carpet, and there was this puddle underneath me. He was so disgusted. Plus, when I put off the jacket of my husky just because the jacket was pretty wet. There were, well, there was some fur coming off. He was so disgusted. He was like, really, he was kind of kicking me out after 20 minutes and saying, oh yeah, I need to get this place in or back in order. It's like, oh, <laughs> nice. <laughs> yeah, I'm coming back here. <laughs> sure, I'm feeling really welcome. Uh, so, no. But, 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 he came up with a good thing. Well, he just gave me some forms, like, yeah, I should just go service. I just shall fill them in and stuff like this. And I was like, what is this? What is he giving me? And I googled it. And, um, yeah, so he's checking me for PTBS. No, PTSD. Yeah, PTBS is German and PT PTSD. Hmm. Not too bad. I mean, I had a wonderful childhood. And I found out that <laughs> the symptoms of ADHD and PTSD is <laughs> pretty similar. So I'm, I'm feeling I'm feeling better with this stuff. So I really have to do the survey and just probably do it. I mean, you can do it online and then online they are telling you what the results are. So you don't have to send it someone who I'm not really into. But hey, yeah, and then I also need to call my doctor. <laughs> it's too late for this for this week. So um, our doctors are just um, 
reachable very on a very very limited scale. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, for this week, it's done. It's over. We catch on to Friday, Fridays, Wednesdays, and Fridays in Germany. The doctors just are open till noon. So everything and the after twelve, what is it? A.M. P.M. Like noon, like noon, noon. <laughs> yeah, they are giving you the finger, you know. Like, yeah. So hey, <laughs> awesome. Uh, well, I should call in because last week I got my MRT of my knee, and so. I should do some more stuff into this, but I made a total new place and I had bad luck with surgeries in the past. Um, I know, I'm, I'm, I'm almost, I'm, I'm so sure that this knee needs some surgery because it's weaker and it's more like wobbly like the other knee and with the other knee, with the right knee, I had to do it. I think when I turned 18, around 17, 18 years old. So. Oh, I'm so old. I was 17, 18 years ago. Okay. Okay. Awesome. <clears throat> yeah, okay. So when I had this knee done, um, I had issues for some time there. Oh, oh shit. Yeah, and my wrist is messed up, so more messed up joints is probably not the coolest thing. But I need to do it. Needs It needs to get done because otherwise I can't start working out anything. Because my, my wrist is really messed up. And they told me it is red messed up and they can't do anything about it. They just can cut the nerve for the that transfers the pain. So yeah. So I have to work out with my legs mostly. I mean <sighs> That's so awesome. <laughs> hey, I have an awesome life. Who wants to change? <laughs> Shit. Okay, um, let's get further. So, yeah, my knee, so, yeah, and uh, I don't know where to go, and, yeah, I mean, I don't know how long I would have to wait to get actually a surgery appointment, because I think there are so many emergencies going on. Well, I heard about a lot of them. Um, I don't know. Well, probably not in the orthopedic sector, but you never know. So, hey, this is an awesome life. Uh, I have joints I not really that aren't really useful. I have a um, head that's <laughs> keep doing its own shit. stuff, stuff. Um, yeah, and I just can't keep up with any of this. It's just okay. Resume of the week. I survived it. I survived it. I didn't get healthier. I didn't get more organized. I just survived it. And I'm standing back on my spot, so there is no dog. So <laughs> they close the doors. So my furry trio isn't here. So yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, that's. Uh, I mean, yeah, that's the other thing with the like psychologist, psychiatrist. I don't know. Uh, this stupid OCD guy. Uh, I just, he was into the dog fur. I was like, <laughs> wait till you see the cat fur. I probably have left one watching. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, yeah. I mean, it's not the first one I'm not into. And, um, the last time a psych, one of those mental doctors got onto my nerves, I 
just, I wasn't into talking anymore. I just sat there and she really had to, she had a hard time getting information out of me because I was so dumb. I was like, okay, I need help. So I have to go there, but I don't like that lady. So I was giving her a really hard time. I, I read that this is called selective mutism. <laughs> Asperger's symptom. <laughs> yeah, so I, I mean, I, I'm doing the same stuff. I did the same stuff when I was still in contact with my parents or when I'm just, when I'm saying something and people aren't listening to me, I'm starting. And if people are continuously interrupting me, then I'm just, I'm not talking anything. Like then, um, I'm pulling everything out of this conversation and I'm on my very own island. So um, one of my colleagues actually loved that thing because, well, I, I this was a tip I gave him like with working out, like, okay, when it's getting really, really tough, um, I'm, I'm on my island. Just don't try to talk to me because I'm on my island. And um, he really liked that statement. So yeah, he's also, I don't know what he has, like, <laughs> he's a nice guy, but uh, mentally um, he was, <sighs> how do you say? Yeah, he was effed up pretty bad. So as far as I heard of his ex-wife, so I don't know what she did, but she must have done um, an awesome job. Uh, because he hates, well, everybody told me that he hates women and, uh, but we got along really, really well. So yeah. Hey, <laughs> um, so nevertheless, yeah, that's my stuff. And I'm just looking around <laughs> time because this is just distracting me so much. I, I, I just, I just need to show you my room. And I mean, it's looking nice in my back. I'm just, I'm just giving you. So I have some boxes. I want to fill them up and there are some things I don't know where to put. So this is down there. So I have some spots some stuff in my very, very old apartment. So before we even move together about like tiki stuff. So this is actually in that box. We have more. Oh yeah, I have Karl May books that are in the box underneath. So, and I kept those boxes to put in my, the projects, my done projects. I probably want to sell <laughs> at a certain point. So yeah, some, some pictures I still have also from school and stuff. So yeah, my, <clears throat> my crazy Julia and um, the two frames, well, I don't have filled. So the U and the L, they are, oh, not, not just the, the U, L, and it's an R and an A. Yeah. So, um, so just for the, um, so my crazy Julia frame thing. Um, yeah, the, the one that's not filled in is behind the upper box. So yeah, it's also nicely covered. <laughs> Yeah, this is something else I have to do, but um, I want to do a huge project with a lot of flowers. So probably I will have some that I can put in there. Okay, and now I have to show you my room. This is crazy. So we're starting to the right, which is the room before this. So actually I want to put everything. So this one is allowed to stay here and probably one or two on top, but um, that's it organized in here and nice and smooth and stuff like this but um hey so plus yeah they are supposed to be free and plus this one should be full and that's it probably one or two boxes up on top okay but um yeah let's go let's go let's do this come on so this is my place so when you're looking you're like seeing this one yeah i turned it around because yeah mirroring yeah, yeah. So, <laughs> um, 
yes, I'm a hoarder, and probably no, I'm not. <coughs> because I'm just, um, sorry, collecting different servers, uh, so like egg boxes. Um, and I think I want to make like paper myself with those pieces, but yeah, let's see. So yeah, <laughs> yeah, I have I have enough space to move my mouse. And um, yeah, so yeah, this this tower got lower. Um, I freed this up, and the pet, my pets, so the cats were really happy because well, the dog is always sleeping there. It's she's never on there. So yeah, hmm. another project. Yeah, my my huge egg box project I've started, and um, well, it's it's a huge project. So this the one I put into seventeen. Well, yeah, I know I just put like 10 boxes, so I want to make, get rid, or work on 10 boxes per day at least. Let's see if I can make that happen. So, yeah, nice, right? Oh, yeah, and um, this is what I thought about making for the 24th day things. Like, woo! Ah, no, my. PC has turned on as so I want to put it up a little bit and then I got inspired by this beautiful thing here. So I'm kind of making 24 of those. Well, it's 20 of those and four of these half and I want to put things in there. And then of course 24 numbers. And then filling them step by step. So I'm not getting too I'm not having too much stuff to do in December because it was super crazy last year. Super, super crazy. Okay. <sighs> yeah, my my list. And I haven't still edited this one. Sorry, need to do this. But I have to edit this one, so probably I get into something and I'm just starting editing. <laughs> on my phone. Just on my phone. Yeah, it's so nice. It's so... <sighs> Okay. See you next week. So, ooh, um, yeah. See you next week. Um, <laughs> hopefully, it's looking much much better than. Now I have a motivation to do actually to do something about it, right? <laughs>